Today I'm going to give you guys a quick overview on the new Lamborghini Urus. Hi guys, my name is Christian and this is Vehicle Virals. In this channel I provide helpful car guides and informative overviews on some of the latest cars just like this one. Make sure to subscribe that way you don't miss any future helpful content here on this channel. Lamborghini Urus overview starting now. I mean, where do I even start? Let's just go ahead and take a second to admire this beauty. Lamborghini doesn't just call it an SUV, they call it an SSUV, which stands for Super Sport Utility Vehicle, which according to Lamborghini, it's the first of its kind. And technically they're right. Most people won't know the following. This is Lamborghini's second production SUV that they've built. The first one debuted back in the mid 1980s and it went by the name LM002, also known as the Rambo Lambo. The Aura stays true to its Lamborghini DNA we are all familiar with. It carries a lot of the same iconic shapes and features that you might find in some of the other models like the Lamborghini Huracan and the Lamborghini Aventador. The letter Y style that you find on the side of the vehicle, the headlights and the taillights give it a familiar yet fresh look. So think about it like this, it's a super sports car at heart, but it does carry the utility and functions of an SUV. Not too shabby. The Urus comes equipped standard with 21 inch wheels with the option to be able to get 22 inch or 23 inch wheels. Well, what about the braking system? I mean, at a curb weight of 4,850 pounds and a V8 twin turbo engine that produces 650 horsepower and 627 pound feet of torque. You bet the Urus is equipped with top of the line braking system. Well, yeah, carbon ceramic brakes with massive rotors. In fact, it's actually the biggest rotors ever put on any production car in the world. And the exhaust. Yeah, the exhaust. Just listen. Moving on to the interior. The interior, like most models in the Lamborghini lineup, is inspired by fighter jets with some of the same special switch gears. Combine that with exotic Italian leather and your choice of trim, either aluminum, carbon fiber, or wood, and you might just be left speechless. Inside you'll find three TFT displays, one for gauge instruments, one for the infotainment center that controls settings like navigation and basic media controls, and one for comfort that controls climate control, heated seats and cool seats and such things. The Urus also has six different drive modes, you know, because two or three just isn't enough. Three dedicated for off-road driving and three dedicated for regular street driving. The driving modes are displayed in Italian, so for the sake of understanding, I'll go ahead and list them in English terms. The off-road settings include dirt, sand, and snow. And the everyday modes include street, sport, and track. The Lamborghini Urus would be the first Lamborghini that comes with driver assistant technology, such as adaptive cruise control, automatic emergency braking, Android Auto, and Apple CarPlay. Oh, and wireless charging, and a heads up display. As far as cabin space goes, you'll have the option to purchase the four seater or the five seater. By the looks of it, it looks like it'll be difficult to get some taller passengers in the rear just because of the slope of the roof of the vehicle. The Lamborghini Urus will be considered an entry level Lamborghini. Entry level folks, entry level Lamborghini, yep. Only $200,000. According to Lamborghini, this car is gonna double their car sales worldwide. Just around 3,185 brand new Lamborghini Urus will be finding new homes here in 2018. But just know, if you are looking to purchase one, the Lamborghini Urus is sold out for the rest of this year and for most of 2019 already. Well guys, that was my overview for the Lamborghini Urus. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and make sure you hit the notification bell right next to the subscription button. What did you guys think of the new Lamborghini Euros? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. Till next time.